Tom's party arrives at Wazette Castle. They are given a warm welcome by King Kuri. Yet Mont knew perfectly well. Kuri's hospitality would not come without a price. Leonis must prove itself of value, lest they be cast to the wolves. And so Mont set out, with Glacella's noble thieves, Rubius, to capture the nearby Venice fortress. Leonis and Wazette. Just what has become of their once steadfast alliance? shoulders for far too long, and he lies in wait just before us. Once we've broken his defenses, victory is ours. Lady Mashari has been taken captive. Ziza huh? and Vistral have defected. As far as we know, they are taking Lady Mashari to Leona's castle. I, I cannot believe that those two would resort to treason. Darling. I know. Retreat it is. Leonis is Horn's ally. 
The next you meet King Elder, ask that he takes care of Schutzelt for me. Yes, your highness. So Schutzelt is still at Leonis's mercy. Then I have a message for the king as well. Tell him that if anything happens to Schutzelt, Leonis will have made itself a new sworn enemy. I said enough, Engelbert. Forgive my impertinence. No need. I understand your concern. After all, you and Schutzelt have known each other since long before Solidus was established. You consider us closer than blood, Your Highness. Then you should believe in Leonis for his sake. Understood. Now then, we withdraw. It is time we made our way to Leonis Castle. We shall continue to journey toward Wazette Castle. I see. And what of you, Dia? Will you accompany us to Leonis Castle? Apologies, Your Highness, but I will be going to Wazette as well. Are you certain? But what of the situation in Ovis? I wish nothing more than to return home as soon as possible. But alas, after claiming the nation of Hindler, Rundal surpasses even the mighty Horn. I see. You hope to gain Leonis' support as well. Yes, Your Highness. But that is not the only reason. I am indebted to these Leonis soldiers for allowing me to accompany them this far. I hope to repay them. A fair decision. King Rob, there is one more thing we have yet to mention. We retrieved some ancient relics from Anvil Castle. Four, in fact. Four ancient relics, you say? However, all were stolen by Sodaly's underlings. So he has acquired four relics. A frightening revelation. Forgive us, your highness. We were left with no choice but to flee after the loss of Queen Helena and Sir O. I had not yet been informed. I pray that their souls may find peace. Thank you, your highness. You must go quite far out of your way to avoid Sodaly's forces. Shall I arrange a convoy? Much appreciated, but we will manage on our own. And I shall pray that your blades remain sharp and your shield sturdy. I leave the rear guard to you, Of course, Your Highness. With that, I do believe it is high time we embarked. <sighs> We're going through the forest again? Remember the last time we walked in broad daylight? What other choice do we have? If Sodaly's forces were to find us... As she says, we would not be able to handle them on our own. For the time being, I see no sign of any threat. So it seems. Though we should stay on guard. No doubt there are plenty of bloodthirsty beasts lurking among these woods. Masheree has been imprisoned within Leona's castle. 
and Stern is to travel there, to keep the people of the castle in line. Such will allow us to maintain control of Leona's castle, even should Rog launch an assault. Let us be on our way. Whisper, my dearest. Can you walk? Oh, of course. Still alive, I see. You took your time getting here. <laughs> My apologies. I must say, though, you held your own against those Fennus dogs. Anyway, you can breathe easy now. So you brought them. As promised. Victora and Lawartha. You can count on both of them. So this is Mott. <laughs> this is interesting. So you're Mott. Glacella has told me much about you. Glacella? Victor is like an older sister to Lady Glacella, you know. It is that so? Why the gray face? Something troubles me. I'm listening. We shall have to talk later. They're coming. Damn! There's no end in sight! Just what is going on here? We were the ones to press the assault. Their morale hasn't faltered. Those savages. Can they not comprehend that their numbers dwindle? Actually, their numbers seem to have only grown. What? Impossible. There's no other explanation. Reinforcements have joined their ranks. That's what you were worried about, wasn't it? Yes. Why hasn't Moraga shown himself? Did you not find it odd? Maybe he intends to make a grand entrance. <laughs> that is precisely the case! Oh, you wench! To think that you were pleading for your life just moments ago! How pathetic he must be to have not seen through my performance! Stay calm, Lilith. Do you sense it? I know, Lord Mont. <sighs> He's coming. Moraga is nigh. The real battle begins now. Be on your guard. Sure he has been taken captive? I can't believe it. Horn has fallen into internal dissension. What's more, Queen Helena and Sir O are... Yes, I know. I had hoped against hope that it were not true. But alas... Lord Mont... I have to help Ma 
luxury. I understand how you must feel, but we have other duties to attend to. We cannot leave King Alda and Shipsal in King Kori's clutches. I know that. For now, let us return to Wizette Castle. We can ask His Majesty for guidance. Would that be acceptable? As you say, Lilith. We should speak with Father and decide which nation to align with. Horn or Wazette. Uh, excuse me. How is Shitzelt doing? He's fine. What a relief! The shield of Horn himself threatened us. He said that if anything were to befall Shitzelt, it would be on our heads. You need not worry. He's with Father now. Recovering from his injuries at Wazet Castle. If that's the case, there should be no issue uniting with Horn. King Rob said as much. At present, we ought to join hands with Leonis and fight together as allies. I see. We wish for that as well. By the way, who might you be? I hail from Ophis. Our country has crumbled under Rundal's assault, and I have come seeking your assistance. She has fought valiantly with us every step of the way, so please... Rundal clearly poses a threat to us as well. We will gladly lend you our swords. But before that... We have some unwanted company to deal with. Mont, you worm. I'll kill. Kill you. Kill. Kill them all. Kill. King Raga, what is ailing you? Apologize, driving him into such a state. That was no small feat. Astonishing, really. Truly, to think you've grown this much. Next time, I promise. 
You should rest now, Lord Mont. We can't. We must return to Wazette Castle. Father and Shitzel must be concerned for us. I would ease their worries as soon as we can. Lord Mont, you've become so strong, beyond question. I must inform you of Glacella's plans. Plans? Tomorrow morning, the break of dawn will be the signal. The break of dawn? And what exactly will she be doing? What else? Starting the rebellion. <sighs> You'll all be standing by within the castle. Glacella will charge the castle with Rubius in tow. When the time is right, you'll help them make their way inside. You don't appear to be on board with this plan. Are you worried about Princess Mashari? You know about that? She is being held within Leonis Castle. How do you... Let us just say that I have eyes and ears most everywhere. I know you want to make a quick departure for Leona's castle. I promise to protect her, no matter what. Moreover, our alliance with Horn should be a benefit to Glacella as well, so... I see. Very well. You seem to have thought this through well enough. We shall postpone the rebellion. You're able to postpone? Don't worry. I'll make sure to explain it to Glacella clearly. I'll tell her that you'll establish an alliance with Horn and find a way to rebuild Leonis, after which you shall return to us. But we need your promise. The next time you fight, it will be for Glacella. I understand. You have my word. 